ডেটা সায়েন্স ফাউন্ডেশনের প্রেসিডেন্ট শ্রী গৌতম ব্যানার্জি এবং তার অর্গানাইজেশনের ঐকান্তিক প্রচেষ্টায় টোয়েন্টি সেপ্টেম্বর টু বিশ্ব বাংলা কনভেনশন সেন্টারে অনুষ্ঠিত হল সপ্তম আন্তর্জাতিক ডেটা সায়েন্স সামিট ডেটা সায়েন্সের পরিব্যক্তি ও ব্যাপক প্রয়োজনীয়তা সম্পর্কে এই বিশেষ আলোচনা সভায় প্রধান অতিথি হিসেবে উপস্থিত ছিলেন শ্রী দেবাশিস সেন তিনি তার দীর্ঘ জীবনের অভিজ্ঞতা থেকে ডেটা সায়েন্সের গ্রহণযোগ্যতা ও ব্যক্তি সম্পর্কে বিশেষ অভিমত প্রকাশ করেন এবং উক্ত বিষয় সম্পর্কে তিনি মিস্টার নিরুপম চৌধুরীর ব্যাখ্যামূলক বক্তব্য পূর্ণমাত্রায় সমর্থন করেন We have uh, launched a survey which more than 150 companies around the globe have answered. And actually there are two main uh, trends that we have observed. One is to use data analytics to speed up operational processes, to reduce costs and, and different other benefits. But the key one is actually how to innovate, how to use data analytics to innovate in terms of enhancing the product and designing new services. So basically the service design used with data is the, is the next wave in the future to uh, make the business grow. So I'm super happy to be here actually and, and learning from the different uh, actors of the ecosystem. So I see we have academics, we have government, we have uh, companies, uh, both manufacturing, consulting, IT. And for us as LAA, it's amazing the opportunity to share. So this is a book that we have uh, published about innovative practices. So how innovative companies are speeding their innovation process. So, I'm enjoying this conference. I'm looking forward to meet smart people, smart companies, and collaborate to further develop and publish in the near future a book like this, but with Indian cases. What about this? Um, I'm enjoying very much the seventh International Data Science Summit in Kolkata. It's a great event full of different experts on the topic of data science, data analytics, big data. And we see that the use of big data and the business use is growing in the world. So in terms of education, I think we will learn a lot from all those uh, experts here. The acceptability is huge. It's actually already a very buzz buzzword, you know, uh, data science. Everybody knows about it. But I think there needs to be a little bit of demystifying or demystification of artificial intelligence or augmented intelligence. And um, this Data Science Summit is a great effort to do that because it talks about applications, it talks about uh, how to do it and the skills around it. It, it, it is a good confluence of both uh, industries as well as uh, education uh, partners. Yeah, definitely it has improved uh, from the previous years because I am associated with the Data Science Foundation for uh, from the beginning and I'm also in the Executive Council uh, for the Data Science Foundation. But uh, the difference that I have seen from the previous years and now is like uh, more uh, advanced technologies came. Uh, in, in fact, in the last two, three years, like I mean the enhancement of artificial intelligence and data science technologies, those being uh, in the place. Good unquote, if you talk about data science, uh, this is the main summit that happens in India since the last six years and this is the largest one as well. Now, uh, you know, why do we do the summit and you know, what kind of, uh, you know, uh, benefits, you know, people, uh, you know, get. Uh, whether we talk about the speakers, we talk about the audience, uh, you know, who come there. So, there are a couple of things that we are looking forward to, you know, this summit especially, uh, is that, uh, you know, we mostly in seminars and events, uh, on any kind of technology, uh, you know, whether you call it cybersecurity, IoT, uh, or you talk about uh, you know the Industry 4.0, uh, you know, or you talk about blockchain. Mostly, what we have seen is that you know these seminars focus on you know what are the good things happening, what are the success stories, so that the CIOs and the CTOs of the world, uh, you know, they can invest more and you know there can be you know more uh, products, uh, offerings, products. One of the things uh, that we do uh, in this summit is that we talk about failures as well because it's very really important uh, for the stakeholders 
uh, whether you are on the buyer side, whether you are on the consumer side, whether you are the end user of a product, or you are a service provider or a vendor, is to understand the challenges. And why is it important here? Because this is something that uh, the IT-enabled services uh, has never seen before.